We will find the monster, kill it, and win. Or get eaten. 50-50, really. Welcome back, everyone. It's FNHUSA57 here. We are back on Evolve. Today I have another Elite skin for you. This time the Elite skin will be for Bucket, which is the Tier 2 support character. And uh, I should let you know that you do have to get all the first stars with uh, Griffin to unlock Bucket. And oh, then uh, go ahead and get all three stars with every item uh, for Bucket to actually get the Elite skin. And uh, first thing you'll notice, we're playing a game of Nest. I like to do the weapon showcases in the game of Nest because it's pretty quick and relatively easy to do. So, of course, you notice that uh, Bucket has this rocket launcher, which uh, the normal coloring is black and uh, black and yellow, kind of like a dirty yellow color. And in this case, you actually have blue is the primary color, and then white and gold. And uh, the really neat thing is the gold on the rocket launcher is actually the missiles. So uh, as you can see, I'm shooting gold-plated missiles. So um, kind of weird, not kind of sure why they went with gold for the missiles. It's like uh, pimp missiles. I don't know, weird. Anyways, looks cool though. The white pattern is on the top of the rocket launcher, so that makes it look really interesting. Now, the bad thing is, because I guess it would actually change the color of Bucket's head, is your UAV does not get colored. Uh, so the UAV is the normal skin, but your actual uh, sentry guns that you throw out here, as you can see, they have a gold head, the blue body, and uh, gold guns. So that's actually kind of cool. And uh, I like to throw the sentry guns out around the nest because they'll turn and start shooting at the nest, or uh, in this case, the monster that uh, just decided to show up with a minion. Um, I am playing with bots right now, which uh, usually is a good thing, but uh, sometimes it's a bad thing because the bots will go ahead and do stuff that you don't want them to do. Uh, like in this case, I don't want them to trap the monster. I want to go kill the eggs, but, uh, oh well, not really a big deal. Uh, as you can see, I got those turrets out, which, the turrets actually do quite a bit of damage to the monster. Your guided missiles don't really do uh, much damage at all to the monster, so they're kind of just a secondary weapon for you to use once you, uh, have already placed your turrets, and your turrets are shooting at the monster. Uh, and since the turrets have the elite camo on them as well, that makes it really cool because basically the turrets are something that you're going to look at more than the rocket launcher itself. As you can see, I've got you know, all those turrets out right now and they're all shooting at the monster, which we might just go ahead and kill this monster. Uh, he's getting away. I'm not going to bother killing him. And just head to the next egg. And uh, this is actually... Primarily, the main reason that I would use Bucket is in a game of Nest because of the fact that the sentry guns can be placed near the egg and then uh, you can move on and the sentry guns will continue to damage the egg. So, I uh, definitely wish that the UAV um, actually had a camo instead of just being the normal color because everyone else, all their weapons get the camo. Even uh, if you play as Maggie, Daisy has a camo, which is really cool, but uh, in this case, well, I guess they didn't want to make Bucket have like a weird blue looking head. And uh, I can kind of understand why they would do that, but still. Now, I should also mention that I got these camos. For the most part, I unlocked all the elite camos before the, la the update came out. That actually made it easier to unlock the camos, which I'm uh, not quite sure how I feel about that. Um, now it's quite a bit easier to unlock elite, so uh, you don't have to do as much Someone with your down. weapon. Which, uh, any of you that watch the video and see and like the camo, uh, you'll like to know that. So the third star is a lot easier than what it used to be, um, which, yeah, to each his own on that one. But I do like just deploying these turrets. You can see I'm going to deploy the maximum that I can have, which is five turrets. And then uh, they'll be shooting at that egg, and I'm going to go back to my rocket launcher and start shooting 
these gold-plated missiles at the egg. Uh, again, not sure why the missile itself is gold-plated, but it definitely looks cool. Very glad that they changed the camos from the beta because the elite skin in the beta, which uh, I was, did get a couple of the elite skins and I uploaded those videos if you wish to check them out, um, but they were black and uh, silver with gold accents. So the camos actually really did not look that good, whereas now the camo is a dark blue, like a navy blue, with gold accents and uh, white or not even really a white as much as it is silver. Uh, here I got all my little sentry guns lined up. You can see they're all shooting at this egg here. And there we go, we won. So, personally I think it's a really cool camo, uh, especially since they made the, cam the elite camos easier to get now. You definitely should go for it. And uh, hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, comments, anything like that, post a comment. Otherwise, give the video a like and go ahead and subscribe to my channel for more videos. I will be covering the rest of the elite skins for the characters and the monster. So, thanks for watching.